What's up team? This is one of the three glute workouts for you at home. This is all gonna be body weight, so tempo and form is everything. Slow down, pay attention to your movement, pay attention to your posture, make sure you're getting into that posture as best as possible, and slow the pace, okay? The directions in terms of reps and rounds are gonna be in the email, because uh, every week it'll be different, so just watch what I'm doing, pay attention, okay? Here, tabletop, hydrants, okay? Both hands and knees are of equal distance, okay? You don't want to have your knees together and your hands wide, because your core will change. You want to have them equal distance, you're gonna do a three slow count. So it's up, then it's one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And that'll equal two. You're gonna continue on to hit your rep goals for this week. Remember, this is single sided exercise, so make sure you're doing the same thing for the opposite leg as well. That's exercise number one. Number two, we're gonna do a single leg bridge. Okay? You're gonna come down. First, make sure your heels are as close to your glutes as possible. If they're far away, you're gonna do more hamstring. So you want them close so you can stay certain you're focusing on your glutes. You're gonna lift into a bridge. You're gonna extend that leg and then drop. And then raise. And then drop. And then raise. And then drop. And then raise. Now notice, my knees are the same height. Don't be here. You take away from the exercise. Keep your knees and your thighs the same height. That's all you need to lift. And use that heel to press down. Again, single-sided exercise, so please make sure that you do the same for both rounds. And again, read your email for your rep count for this first round. Then it's going to be the second week and then the third week, okay? All right, number three. You're going to come down into what's called a yogi squat. You're going to do the best you can. You might want to use a wall to support you, but this is a yogi squat. Notice that my hips are lower than my knees. That's where you want to be, okay? For some of you, it might take you some time to get here. That's okay. Don't do this as your first exercise. Do it as your third. Use your elbows to point in. And once you're here, you're going to step, side. Step, side. Step, side. Opposite way. Step, side. Step, side. Step, side. Four steps to the left. Four steps to the right. Every time it's four steps, that's one rep. Four steps, that's the other count. That's two reps. Four steps, three reps, four steps, four reps, so on and so forth, okay? And then the last and final exercise here is going to be a kneeling thruster. So here, you want to open up your knees. You want to bring your toes together. You're going to drop down as low as you can, and then stand up, down, up, down, up, down. Squeeze your hips, thrust your pelvis together. These are kneeling thrusters. Squeeze, thrust, squeeze, thrust. Okay, make sure you're doing that thrust. Might put a towel, roll up towel under your knees if you're gonna have knee issues or knee pain. All right, and that's exercise number four for your first round of videos.